time to drive around the state and people are hurting and they're looking for a vision for the future. And we are about ready to deliver that message. People are ready for a change. When you're out there on the Western Slope and you are able to spend time and talk to people about the impacts of the Affordable Care Act and what that's gonna do with the premium increases, when the, the war on the coal industry and what that's doing, these are real stories that our party is on the right side of that issue. We must convey that message. And Hillary Clinton was very clear about what she wants to do with the Supreme Court. Uh, she laid out a vision. She is not a strict constructionist. She has a progressive leaning vision of what she wants to do with the court. If you're having trouble convincing people on why they need to support this ticket, all they have to do is refer back and listen to the words that came out of her mouth. That should wake you up. If you stand up for freedom and liberty, if you're concerned about your Second Amendment rights, she wants to take us in a different direction that's not in the best interest of this country. And we must realize that right now there is an enemy that's out there that is threatening the United States of America. All you have to do is look at the news right now where Iran is wanting more money for hostages. We must say no. And it's absolutely true that we must come together. But what I want people to understand and why we're doing this, come election night, half this country is going to be upset. And we understand that. But I want us to really reflect on the fact that it is a privilege to be Americans. Think about all the sacrifices that have been made to be able to give us that right to be able to live in this great country. And it's going to be our party that's going to be the ones that's going to bring us back together and realize how important it is to lay out an agenda that brings us together. Because we are the party that stands up for freedom and liberty. We are the party that talks about racial equality, not the other side. And now is our time to be able to show that message and deliver that in a manner that's inviting. So I want you, when you're out there walking and knocking hard and making those phone calls, to really spend time to talk to people and get them to vote and turn in their ballots. Because I am so proud of the nation that we're in. I'm so proud of each and every one of you that are taking time in your day to be able to help turn this country around. That's, just, that's what we need. And again, I want you to be proud, be smart, smile, be happy about what's gonna happen. I mean, I tell you, don't get down. Don't listen to all the stuff, the negativity that's there. We know what the issues are. We know what we need to do to be able to win this. Let's go, let's run through the tape. So with that, I'll take any questions that you have. I'll tell you, I'm just so fired up, ready to go.